Hello guys, this is Dwight Crunch and I am Lokesh Kapoor and in this video we are going to talk about master add-ons for Elementor. Master add-ons for Elementor is a wonderful plugin for your WordPress website. You can download this plugin from the WordPress repository for free right here. And it also comes with the paid plans and I will leave a link in the description so you can download the paid plan and you also get some commission out of it so the paid plan you know gives you some extended widgets uh, that are not available in free and this will give you enormous control on your wordpress website there are tons of widgets as you can see here in the library and some of the widgets are very crucial and there are many features few widgets you may find in almost all the add-ons and toolkits but they are completely you know new widgets that you may not find in other add-ons so let me talk about those first so as you can see here there is a template library that you may not find in all, in all the plugins and there is custom breakpoint for Elementor you can design a website for multiple resolutions and devices and here is the header and footer builder you know that you may not find in all the add-ons you can find this in elements kit and it also gives you uh, control to create mega menus very easily and it's custom CSS for Elementor you can receive the content for Elementor and here are some designs for landing pages so let me show you my dashboard to uh, how it all works so here I have installed master add -ons. here you can see the dashboard where there is a community like page you can get support documentation video tutorials and all that you can also request a new feature and has all the other add-ons that you can see you can disable the add-ons that you don't use it will uh, help you you know loading the elemental faster on editing and you can enable all the add-ons at once or disable all the add-ons at once so you can check out the you know demo documentation and video tutorial for any add-on as well so this looks very cool and here are some extensions extensions are different from the add-on you can manage the extensions in extensions tab and add-ons in add-ons tab enable disable and check all and the list of you know add-ons and extensions here are the apis where you can set the recapture key you can uh, set the twitter access tokens and here is a white label options for pro version and here is a version control where you can roll back to the previous version if you find any issue with the new version you have installed then you can uh, quickly go back to the previous version and here are some change logs that you can see and here is all the system info so that was a quick intro to your dashboard for master add-ons and let me show you how you can uh, find some interesting stuff here is the MA duplicator, master don't duplicator that will duplicate the page in just no time. So that's also a cool feature. Uh, so let me just add a new section and let me just put it to screen. Cool. So here are a couple of you know widgets that you can see in your pattern. All the widgets of master add ons will have a master add on uh, uh, tag you know in the top right corner of the widget and you can take on top any of them there are a bunch of widgets some are very very exciting like image hotspot like this you can choose an image and then you can set the hotspots from here you can set uh, the content for your hotspot you can set the position like this right so if I want to make it on the google for example I can do this and then I can write in content this is google so it will show me in pop up so this is how uh, hotspot works and some exciting features are also like image hole effects uh, 
develop content, uh, countdown timer, gradient headline like this. So when you uh, choose this, you can go to style and in text color you can find this gradient option and you can choose any gradient like this and you can uh, change the angle to maybe this this is how it works right you can keep it each one and in typography you can possibly go with 800 so that's very cool widget and here is also large my advanced accordion advanced headlines call to actions as well like this advanced accordion you can keep it in a toggle or accordion so design is quite very awesome here is a help documentation for this tutorial and here are some couple of styling options that you can you know play with toggle icon you can change from here so all the you can customize it if you don't like the default design of your accordion and here team slider so you can slide throughout your team you can add the members you can choose the image designation description their facebook URLs, social media URLs, and all that so this will you know, come out so that's wonderful tool you know? and let me show you some more widgets of mastodon there is some domain checker you may not find this widget in all the you know uh, toolkits so this is a default design let me just uh, work on it like uh, I write droidfinch.com and hit on search it will show me solid droidfinch taken but when I search any other domain that's not taken or say anything and when I click the search button it will say yeah it's available so it works very fine so if you have agency landing page or something like that you can use this widget out there and let me show you a couple of more widgets so you have restrict uh, content widget as well you have toggle content widget as well right like this you can toggle between the content and there's some form widget so if you have WP forms installed on your website and if you want to design your form uh, then you can use this widget and assign the WP form inside this you know and saying that WP forms is not installed because I haven't installed the form so like under forms all ninja forms then you can use this widget and design them and have some dynamic table widgets and this image comparison widget so these are all the exciting widgets you can find and in before and after so like this very nice design for before and after and this thing slider as well I already showed you that is the creative links and creative buttons that's very cool widget so if you are using creative button you can use button for your plate links or something and here's another button effect like this this looks quite good a couple of 
plus x. You can use any of them, and uh, you can increase the clip for weight with this kind of button, which are very instigating. So you just to click and then create a link which is as well, like yeah. this you can use creative links you can change couple of options right there like all the content of it icons spacing position and all that next alignment and effects you can change everything and there are a couple of effects as well so you can choose any effect that you like and then hit update uh, this is a lot to explore you can just download the free version of it and you can use it and if you want to you know upgrade anytime you can then upgrade the plugin and here is also header and footer builder so let me show you that as well Down. To use the head and footer builder, we need to make sure uh, that it is enabled, and you can you know check out your template, and then you can go to your save template, then add any template, and go to header, or possibly you can create the existing header, but I will use header and then write MA so I remember that it's uh, made with Mastodon and then you can click on this button right here that will populate all the templates that are existing and there are all the landing pages that you can quickly import in this library so if you check any of that you can see the landing page a nice landing page that you can import just a put of click but it is in the pro version so make sure if you want this kind of template then you purchase the pro version I will leave a link in the description so you get some discount if you want to purchase and you can see a nice landing page that you can import and I am playing with headers so let me go to headers and find some good headers that I can import with ease so here a couple of headers that you can find here let me just click any of it and I can just insert this and just wait for a second and it will be imported right away so it looks very cool you can edit it you can edit the you know logo you can edit the content of it and it will be just live on the website in just a second and like the headers you also have footer design that you can use to create the footer let me show you a couple of footers like this you can see all the footers are you know, very very high rich in colors fonts typography and you know uh, background color and everything is quite very very premium so you can use any of the footer you just quickly get this kind of you know uh, rich footer like this so I hope you enjoyed this video this is all about master addons uh, I'm sure that I have left a lot of you know uh, widgets and extensions that I could cover but if you want to explore more I will recommend you to download this plugin from the repository and then if you want to upgrade then you can go ahead and upgrade the plugin and i have left a link in the description so you can check out this wonderful plugin from there if you like this video please hit the like button subscribe to the channel and please hit the bell icon so you don't miss any new video till then bye bye and have a wonderful day